Hey everyone, Loganetics here, and it's time for System Test 42.0. <laughs> first device why are we on the ceiling we have an FCI MS2 and here's why so system test 42.0 because uh, system test 69 is too far away and 420 is a funny number so 42.0 we're doing a weird system test and this was requested by the simplex 4903 well part of it so we have the MS2 on the ceiling the system is not up to code at all and that's part of it so for batteries, we have, uh, don't mind my nine volts, 18, well, 18 volts right here. For our first pull station, we have the Simplex 2098 and 9636. Pull station is the same over here, 278B. For our first notification appliance, we have the Wheelock 7002T mounted sideways on the 2903-9101 with the white logo, the rare one. And we have a Wheelock alert strobe LED, also from the Simplex 4903, set on 95 Candela. Notification appliance here is very cursed. On the Simplex 2099-9795, we actually have a System Sensor P4R. Very nice wiring, definitely up to code. Simplex 4903-9252, mounted vertically, which is also against code. It's also like that. Perfect. Oh, one more thing that also makes it messed up is I forgot to, when I rewired this, I forgot to put it through the conduit hole so I can't actually close the door. Anyways, let's start with the first pulse station or smoke detector, I guess. Time to re-alarm, and we're doing code three for the coding option. Wait, why did I open that? That thing's loud, really loud. And now time for continuous, so let's activate the ceiling mount pull station. Did it not hit the switch? Oh, that's weird. So you know how I said this is a 9252? Well, guess what? I lied. I took the 4903 9236 shell and behind it is my Wheelock EHE-01, which sounds exactly like a true alert or very similar to a true alert. And the 9252 has the true alert horn. So that's why I said it's a 9252. It's also 15 candela.
All right, ladies and gentlemen, that's it for System Test 42.0. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you again in the next video.